What's up, Rare Moment fam? Happy Monday. Welcome back to the show. I'm AG. This is Cole. We are the Rare Moment. Today, we are back with some pack notes for tomorrow's drop for the Series 3 MGLE Rare Drop in the first Series 3 Holo Icon Drop. Looking forward to it. Before we get into this video, if you like pack notes, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, follow us on Twitter at The Rare Moment. When you're on the go, find us on Spotify. Comment section down below. Let us know who you're excited about in these packs. Let us know if you're going for Legendary, if you're getting in the priorities of anything. Excited to have some conversations about these pack pack drops coming up. So let's get into it here, Cole. Let's fire up that screen share and let's let these guys know what we got going on here and what we can expect. Yeah, so let's get you first prepared here for the Hollow Icon Legendary drop happening tomorrow. So 1,400 packs are going to be uh, available in total. $999 is going to be the price, so very standard there. Uh, nine moments in each pack. One guaranteed Hollow Icon Legendary moment minted out of 99 and one guaranteed MGLE moment minted out of 749. And then the rest are just going to be 4K to 60K base uh, set series three moments. Priority queue, going to be tipping off 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. You're going to need at least a collector score requirement of 25,000 points. And there's going to be 700 packs available in the priority queue. The general queue, going to be tipping off at 10.30 a.m. You need a collector score requirement of at least 10,000 points, and there's also going to be 700 packs available in there. So a nice even distribution as far as the packs go for both queues in the legendary drop. Moving on over to the MGLE drop, our second, I believe, so far of Series 3. A little 8, more 000, affordable here. Yeah, eight, <laughs> definitely. 8,250 packs available in total for sale. $89 is going to be the price for each pack. We're going to have six moments in each pack. One guaranteed MGLE moment, and the rest are going to be 4K to 60K base moments. Just like the Hollow Icon, we're going to have two queues here. The Priority Queue, uh, tipping off 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. You need at least a collector score requirement of 7,500 points. 4,250 packs will be available in this queue. And then for the General, that'll be going off at 2 p.m., you need a collector score requirement of at least 2,500 points, and there will be 4,000 packs available in there. So, with all the details out of the way, we're going to move on over here to our friends at Evaluate Market. We're going to kind of go over some data and analytics over here on the MGLE Series 3 set so far. So, as you can see, the total lowest ask to complete the set so far, $7,231. So pretty cheap compared to Series 2 and, and definitely Series 1. There's only 24 moments so far. Obviously, we're going to get a lot more coming up. I, get, I believe get, get in the blog there's going to be 16 total, yeah. 14 in the drop, and yep. then probably two Challenge Awards. Yep, exactly. So as you can see here, LeBron, as he should be, the cream of the crop here for the MGLE set so far. And we had three Challenge Awards last time. Davion Mitchell, rookie, uh, Trey Young, and then Chris Middleton. And so you can see 263 completed the Mitchell Challenge, 386 completed the Trey Young Challenge, and 303 completed the Chris Middleton Challenge. And then if you scroll down here, you can see the floor right now from the first MGLE drop this series is $95. That's Isaiah Stewart. So we're looking most likely at, not most likely, should pretty much guarantee a cash flow positive pack here. And uh, we're going to head over here for one of the challenges uh, was between January 4th and January 7th. Yep. We had Anthony Davis and CJ McCollum, who we're going to get to in a second. These guys were both needed for a challenge. And we're going to take you over what kind of their moments did in those uh, in those challenges. So Anthony Davis, you can see the day before he's going for about 315, 300, 316, and then on the fourth gets announced that he's going to be in the challenge goes up to 350 349 359 365 370 and then all of a sudden the undercutters come out again yep. as they always do that same day that yep, same, that same day. day within a hours. i don't know 2 hours or so yeah, hours all of a sudden shoots back down 313 304 yep. 307 
309, 312, and then just kind of plateaued really for the next few days, maybe got up $10 or so. Yep. So the undercutters definitely hurt you on that one. You needed a, you had a very quick time frame to sell that Anthony Davis if you wanted to sell the top. And then moving on over to CJ McCollum's <laughs> moment. His moment didn't really go up not, at all. If anything, it much. just kind of plateaued. So here we go again on the fourth or the, the days before going for 149, 148, 150, 153, 155. Then he gets announced for the challenge 153, 157, 158, 159, 162. Uh, and then starts to come down 142, 145, 150, 150, 150. So pretty stagnant. Not, not yeah. really anything crazy. Yeah, nothing, nothing crazy. If anything, it comes down a few dollars actually for McCollum. So pretty interesting to see there. Yeah, for those. So obviously, time to give some analysis here on on these things, on these packs. I'll ask you here first. You going for you going for legendary? You going for the rare? Where, where are we going to see Cole at in the queues here? Well, we're not going to see Cole very much tomorrow. Uh, I. Along with the rest of the doormats on Top Shot, I only qualified for the general queue for the MGLE sets or drop. So I got one chance out of four possible queues tomorrow. Don't like my odds. Only 4,000 packs available, and I am sure I'm going to be in the back of the line just <laughs> just like everybody else. So uh, I'll pose it back to you because I know you got some more chances than I do. Yeah. How many chances do you got tomorrow? So I got three chances tomorrow. I'm I, I'm in the general queue for the legendary pack. So I I've been in I've been in the general queue for almost every legendary pack. I've never gotten into one. Crossing my fingers, tomorrow's my first one. Not the sexiest list of moments in that in that legendary pack. I'll start here with the legendary pack for those of you guys getting into it. First off, the collector score in the priority queue is hefty. You're gonna have to be spending a lot okay. of money on this site to get in that. Uh if you're not, that's okay. You're with me in the general. Uh if you've looked at that list of moments, I'm not that impressed with it. You know, I, I went back and kind of looked at what Series 2 legendary moments are going for. The lowest ass is going for about 949 bucks, And that was what, Josh Jackson, right? Yeah, I think that's yeah. Josh Jackson moment. And, you know, there's this is a this is a cash flow positive pack. I mean, every legendary pack should be cash flow positive. The fact that there's legendary moments going for under a thousand dollars is criminal. Number one, just yeah. If the, you're one, the, if if you're one of those guys listing moments for under a thousand dollars, just just get off the site. Okay, <laughs> just leave. Just get off the site. You should be banned. You should be kicked off. It's just well, criminal to be doing. Same that. with the rare packs. If you're listing your rare moment for under eighty nine, you need to be behind yeah. bars. Honestly, you're you have no business being on this site. So don't do that, guys. Don't be those people. You know. Chill. Don't, don't but, be those undercutters, man. But either way, uh, as far as I see it, you got Luka Doncic. That's probably going to be the top dog of this legendary pack. That's who you're going to be hoping for. Before I get on with it, I got a bone to pick real quick. Okay. <laughs> top shot. What the hell are we doing here? Another Marcus Smart legendary moment. The guy had a legendary moment last year. He's had countless rare moments. He's been in every hustle and show pack. What's with the hard on for Marcus Smart? <laughs> the guy's a... The guy's... A, the guy... The guy's averaging 10 points in his freaking career. Yeah. And he's we're got treating 17 the, moments on this We're side. treating this guy like he's a freaking all-star here. Please. So, <laughs> can we see can we see anyone else here? Maybe you're I mean, go back, go back guys and go ahead and 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 go look at I'm not going to screen share it here right now. Go and look at who these players are they got. It's not an impressive pack. If you go and look at last year's pack, there's a lot of big names out there. You got the Morants, you got the Currys, Greens, LeBrons. You got all these guys in there. So maybe they're just saving the big names for later in the year. But yeah. I'm not too impressed with this drop. Maybe nonetheless, there's some really good challenge yeah. awards possibly too. Nonetheless, I'll still be going for it. Yeah. So moving on to the rare. Moving on to the rare. Moving on to the rare. So I'll, I, I'm in the priority queue for the rare. I'm in the general queue. I've had some really good luck in these rare packs. If you guys watched the last one, I pulled an Embiid, and then I also pulled a Scotty Barnes. So that was <laughs> that, that pack was, a, was nuts. That was a big positive pack for me. I will always come out here and say these are positive investments. Okay, they absolutely should be, unless you got morons listing it for less than what we're buying the packs for. Yeah. Which, like I said, get off the site if you're doing that. Don't yeah. bother. So 
names that we're looking for in this in this pack here. I'll rattle some names off here and what we got. The two top dogs, we got LaMelo Ball and we got Steph Curry. So if you're looking to get in this rear pack, those are the two top dogs you're looking to get. Those guys should be going for, in my personal opinion, five six $600 each. There's Yeah, minimum. There's no way they should be going less than that. Then you got guys like Vucevic. So you got Desmond Bain, who's having a pretty good year. You got Andrew Wiggins in there. Then you kind of start getting more, you know, you got Kemba yeah. Walker. Then you kind of start getting more to that bottom where you got Dorian Finney-Smith. Kevin Love's making an appearance. I didn't even know that guy was even still in the league. <laughs> uh, Patty Mills, you know, he's probably down near that bottom of the barrel. So, you know, it's, you know, it you, you got some sexy players and you got some not sexy players. That's usually how we go with the with these pack drops. But at the end of the day, you also got your very small opportunities for rookies again, whether you're in the legendary, whether you're in the rare, which also makes it worth it. It's really the only reason why we get into Series 3 these days is for rookies. So, yeah. And obviously you got an opportunity to potentially make some money with some challenges. Yeah. Although, just based off those two examples we gave you, obviously that's probably not the case for every moment. We yeah. could have showed more. But yeah. those ones, the Anthony Davis, yeah. you had a very short window to capitalize on. And the CJ McCollum, there wasn't really a window at all yeah. to capitalize on any profit. Last notes I will say for you guys here as far as analytics goes to give you guys an idea for those of you who are looking to hold on to this to see what a flash cha or a challenge for this looks like. They've already announced there's going to be the Holo Icon and MGLE challenge announced Wednesday. So yep. Yep. releases tomorrow. They're going to announce it Wednesday. What they did with the MGLE of the last drop, it was seven moments and then it, you needed two, either series one or series two, MGLE handles moments also in those challenges. So you're probably looking for something similar there, right? Five to seven players, two other moments from previous sets, and who knows who the players are going to be. So yeah. kind of random there. If you're lucky enough to get one, you're lucky enough to get one. But I want you guys to be mindful because as we showed you, yeah, you got two hours. You, you, got, you got a window that's this big to you know sell at the top here before the undercutters start coming out. So if you guys are getting into these packs, be mindful, look for look for that announcement Wednesday. As soon as they announce it, you need to be on top shot. You need to be monitoring it, get your listing up and be ready for it. With that being said, we're gonna be in the queues tomorrow. We're looking forward to more rare drops, more legendary drops. We hope you guys are too. Hit that comment section up down below. Let us know who you guys are excited about, what your thoughts are on these packs. And uh, we can have some discussions about it. So look out for more content this week. We'll be letting you guys know what, what, what else we're coming out with. We're looking forward to it. You guys enjoy the rest of your week out there. Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Head over to Twitter. We're doing a giveaway. It's pinned at the top. Go, there, go over to Twitter. See what you got to do to get yourself a free Jokic moment. We'll see you guys in the queue tomorrow, guys. Good luck collecting out there. Peace.